Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new Minecraft video. Now today we're in a real world because I want to show you this in a real world environment. Well, not a real world, like, JK, it's not because, it's because I forgot to put it on super flat, okay? So, we're going to start off by getting a command lock, and today we are going to actually be doing a boss bar timer, a boss bar version of it. So, how we're going to start off is first by just prepping the area, and by doing that, I mean just kind of making a large area. Just a large area for our, us to experiment in. Um, let's do air. Oh, that was loud. Okay. I'm just gonna pick up these seeds. I forgot to do title drops off too. <laughs> I forgot to do so many things. Sorry. Okay. So first, let's start off by something that's not in the command block. Scoreboard, objectives, add, we can call it time, and then it's a dummy scoreboard. Now, this is actually, so because there's no slash boss bar set, I need a boss bar. Here, I'll add one, we can call it... Actually, I forgot how to add one. Um, I think you just put in quotation marks. I think. I don't know. Um, we can say time. No. Um, hey, guys. So I just realized something. I watched my video. I called it one. Why I called that? was because the ID, it wouldn't let me name it, and for some reason I thought I could do like this. No, 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 no. Maybe... This? No. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna call it one then. And then its display name could be... Time. Really? Really? boss bar and so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a command and basically link those two together so we're gonna do data um actually no sorry not data execute store result ah, into a boss bar and it is the one boss bar and store it into its value and what we're going to do is we are going to run data get, oh, wait, not data. <laughs> run scoreboard um, players get my time so we're getting the time and we're storing it into the boss bar so now we can uh boss bar um set one and we can set it um set its players to add a okay now you can see i have zero now I'm also going to boss bar set, um, and we're setting one, what we're doing to it is we are setting its, um, max, uh, max to 100. 
Oh, that's why I do the max and block part. Okay, then. Now what we can do is we can do scoreboard players add at S time. I forgot to put the amount. So if I do 50, that's half of it. If I do 5, that's 55, which is a little bit more. Um, so we can use the add and subtract because there's no add and subtract for boss bars. We can use that for a timer. So now what we can do is we could just have, let's say, maybe you flick a lever and it does scoreboard objectives. Um, actually, I'm going to put it this way. Scoreboard, um, scoreboard players set, 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 or not set, um, yeah, set, you know, it doesn't really matter, I can type it in, set my time to 100, and then it will, scoreboard, Objective players remove my time, and we're removing one. So I know there's more efficient ways to do this, but I'm just going to do it like this. Now, if we take a lever, you will see that look, it creates a timer. Look at that. And then it will just go to zero. And then we can flip this for it to start again. Now if we want it to be longer, we can either make this deplete faster or deplete um, let or if we want actually we can make it less time by doing this. Now it's super fast. And we can just add more time on to the end of this. This is going to take a million years. Oh, wait, that's a subtract. Wait, right? No, wait. Here, wait, no, it's not. Okay, well, now we can do 100. Uh, 1,000? Oh, that was instant. Oh, yeah, because it's only 10,000. I wonder why it's not subtracting. Scoreboard objectives. Sorry, I'm just gonna set the display, set this for a display. Oh! Wait, what? Oh! Okay. Oh, did it work that time? Okay, well, let's let's just remove one and we can have 100. That means, you see, it's a little bit slower. And you can have, like, a thousand to make it ten times slower. Do you see how slow that is? Oh, wait, it's not even going down because for some reason it doesn't want to have to. Oh, wait, it's because of the max. Oh, my gosh, it's because of the max. here if it's 1000 my max is only 100 so what i have to do is i have to go boss bar um set its ma max boss bar set its max to 1000 now now you can see it will actually work so now currently it's not very smooth i mean Pick a lower number if you want it to be smoother. It's like if we do 100. Oh yeah, I forgot the max is still 1,000. Boss bar set max 100. 
Now you can see, again, it goes down just perfectly. Then, of course, you can hide the scoreboard. Um, ah, no, not below it. <laughs> Sidebar. Boom, there we go. Now look, we have a timer. It's fully adjustable. Um, in fact, what you probably want to do, too, is right after this runs, again, you would probably use a command, chain command lock. I'm just kind of showing this off for the video. You would probably want to do something like execute store result into a boss bar, max run, run data get entity, not entity, no, why, why, why are you messing up, run data get, um, or not data, ah, I keep messing up, scoreboard, players, no, not enable, yeah, my time, so now what it's going to do is no matter what I set this to, now if I set it to a thousand, look, this will work too. So that's also a thing you probably want to add. You want to make sure it runs every time you flick that lever. And basically what it's doing is it's taking, so it sees that it's at a thousand and only for once at a thousand, it sets the max. If it constantly set the max, then it would always be full until it reaches zero because the max keeps on changing. And that's kind of creepy. Whoa, that is scary. Okay, well anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. You guys are the best. Thank you for being amazing and watching this. You guys are amazing. Make sure that you leave a like, subscribe, and share this video with all of your friends. Thank you guys so much for watching, and oh, I ran out of time. Goodbye! Get, get that joke. I ran out of time because the scoreboard's out of time. And that was like my time limit. I, I'm going to try this again. Okay. No! Oh my gosh, I almost died there. Okay. Meant to do this. Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching. Le make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Um, uh, uh, it's going too fast. Um, leave a like, subscribe, share it with all your friends. Thank you guys. Oh, actually, it's kind of going slow. Thank you guys so, 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 so much for what? This thing is taking too long. Can it just go a little faster? Thank you guys so much for watching Village! Thank you guys so much for watching. Please leave a like on this video. And I want to make it to the village before the video time ends on the timer. Get it? Thank you guys so much for watching. And goodbye!